Welcome to the Japanese countryside. This is Niigata and that is a kominka. It's a 160 year old building, I believe. And that is our bus. I, and I'm still shocked that we were able to pull this off. How you doing everybody? This is the only in Japan bus tour, the first one. And I always wanted to do this because I, I tell everybody to go out to the countryside and now I'm bringing people with me finally to show that. Uh, tonight is the big Katakai fireworks event where we have the Yonshakudama, a 420 kilogram fireworks shell that we're gonna be launching up into the sky. It's gonna be quite exciting. Uh, but we've had a, a, our lunch in here. I wanted to share that experience with you. Ojia is the name of the town and uh, we're doing this to support local businesses. I think it's really important to do uh, stuff like this. Um, we have local grannies inside there that cooked our lunch for us. And we're gonna be staying in a local hotel. And I like the way that we source this with local local power. I think the best, let, let's take the long way around. The best resource for the Japanese countryside are the grannies. And we have a couple of them in there. So maybe we, we can go inside there and, and uh, talk to some of them. The food was incredible. Do you wanna see what that looked like? Oh my gosh, it was really good. That's just crazy. <laughs> they have half of half of the logo only, and then somehow it got all small, but it doesn't really matter. It's all about the fun here. Here's the food that we had. It looks so incredible today. Uh, this is like um, local, local, I mean, um, they had like local vegetables inside of it with miso. These are miso potatoes with the local miso made in here, local eggplant, tomatoes, onions. Uh, there's some, uh, uh, I'm not even sure what that was. <laughs> this is like local vegetables, all from the mountains here in Niigata. Um, and uh, yeah, it was just, it was so much food. There's still some left. I had three helpings, so my diet is officially over. But uh, it, it, it's all really good, good food. And everybody so far is, is having a pretty good time, um, despite the fact that I might've talked too much at the entrance of the bus as you're all getting on here. Um, here's a look from the station here for the history of the Only Japan tour. We've got all these wonderful people. We also hired a local guide. I thought it was important to, you know, not me being the guy, but I wanted it to be really local. So we have a, a guide from this area and she's uh, uh, helping helping out and, and being more organized. So I could actually chill a little bit while she does a lot of the explaining. Um, with the uh, uh, local help here. There's there's Brandy and, and some of the other viewers you might have seen before in the past. Leo is here as well, you can see. Um, he's a handful though. I don't think he's ready to do the trip. A lot of people, we have, uh, I think there's 17 or 18 people uh, in the bus here. But so far it's been fun. The, the weather could not be more perfect. The humidity has died off. The sun is pretty hot, but it's gonna cool off this evening and uh, we're gonna have a really great launch. If there's signal, I will, I will share with you the fireworks experience uh, tonight, which I think is a big part of it. Um, again, I'm just like, I'm just still kind of shocked that we were able to pull this off and get rent a bus, a driver, a guide, and uh, have our own fireworks uh, tour here. It's like the dream is now come true. And what's next? I guess to start the fireworks, huh? Um, tonight we get we have a yatai, which is the uh, here's Nagoka Station. If you if you're curious, this is where we came in. Tonight is the uh, fireworks festival. Before that, we get a ton of street food that we get to get a chance to eat. Um, I might try to live stream that too. Just I wanted to bring you with me on this experience. Look at this. I'm I'm like in deep deep in the countryside. The guide told me that to be to watch out for bears which is no the bunch of the spiders around here. Oh my gosh. Oh, spider. Ugh. Countryside. Jump over here. Oh, sorry. I just saw a dragonfly. Yeah, there are bears around here. So if you make a lot of noise, which I typically do when I'm live streaming, but you're gonna be okay. This is an old Kaminka. Let's go inside. Uh, fingers crossed that there's a signal so I could share with you the kind of places that, like I wanted all locally sourced food on these tours. So um, it was great that we could find this. And this is all thanks to the power of Ide-san who helped me set up this tour. 
Let's go inside this old, old house. Renovated, of course. Look at this. We have we have a, a we have swag. There's a seat cushion. Everybody got a bottle of sake too. That's a good stuff. That's a Kubota. Junmai Dai Ginjo. And here's the hapi as well. So people aren't wearing them yet. Yeah. Say hi to Michael. Hi. I know how you want to be on the live stream. <laughs> Hello. Hello. And here are our wonderful chefs just finished their own tea and their own lunch. They prepared us, uh, the rice was cooked here, which is, um, I think it's called a komata. So they cooked the rice in here. What do you say in Kagama. Hagama. 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 Oh. Hagama. Ah, hi, hi. Hagama. Hi. It's very heavy. I ask how many kilograms. It's really heavy. But the food is very good. Kaji is got them as yone. Kaji. Maki. Maki. Ah. So it, it, it's made, there's some wood in here, so they have a, a flame. So that hot, really hot heat with this very thick metal. You can see this is the fireplace, and they did have actual fire to make the rice. Ah. Takara oishi katta ne. Arigatou gozaimashita. Oh, wow. Is this a group photo? Yeah. So what am I doing here, live stream? Ah! Okay, 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 okay. Sorry. All right. Everybody watching is in the photo too. Oh! Uh, where's Leo? Okay. Cheese. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one. Okay. Hey. <laughs> I wasn't almost. I was almost not in the photo. That would have been. I think that's one of many group photos. Elioka, say hello. It's a handful. Let me show you on the Shinkansen how handful it's. The Shinkansen trip was quite eventful. Leo could get uh, a really nice view. He's waving to every single person on the platform. Everybody got to wave. Leo does not discriminate. And you must wave back. <laughs> this is part of Leo's MO. Yeah, he, we were telling him Shinkansen tomorrow. And he got so excited. Now he's talking about the fireworks because we also told him about the fireworks tonight. He's counting the fireworks right now. So it's gonna be it's gonna be a really cool uh, fireworks uh, event tonight. I'm really close up. God. This is a great venue for the lunch, though. It was big enough for everybody. We had set up tables here. Um, the food was given with this view, which is so awesome. On the tatami mats here, the, the grannies had made these amazing dishes. There's still so much food left. You're gonna have to take a doggy bag or Leo can finish it off. Uh -oh. There he goes. There's so much food still left here. Uh, I like the fact that we, we wrote everything. Lufa with mayonnaise, wild grass, kimpira. So everything had a was was named in English for everybody, so that was good. 
the watermelon was incredible. And these spring rolls, they had miso in it and, and locally sourced vegetables, which are so good with the hukinoto. What? No, it's mine, no! It's yours? Uh, gonna take some more watermelon for the road. We had tempura, local, local vegetable tempura, and then these might have been one of my favorites. What were these? Fried wheat bran. <laughs> That's right. They look like donuts, but they're fried wheat bran. It was so good. Healthy. And now, and now everybody's cleaning up here. Tonight's dinner is going to be the yatai, the, uh, the places that we eat at the festival. So a lot of street food. Uh, I'll try to give you some heads up notice on that because then uh, it'd be nice if more people could join us and have some street food. But if you're in the US, it's gonna be kind of late, I think. But that will not stop me from live streaming street food. There's Diana and Joss. Oh really? Well, I just I just happened to have a you found me card. I think so. I figured that people were gonna. Want Sometimes I'm not prepared. You did not come all the way from Colombia for a you found me card. Where did I put them? Uh oh. We had like the best sake. Oh yeah. Yes. I think everyone is a little yes. bit a little bit happy from the sake. Yes. Oh, I do have that. You found me card. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Was it worth it? Of yeah. course. Don't of course. <laughs> Thank you guys for coming. There's, there's Diana right there. Jaco Adventure says hi. They fill up the water bottle. This was this was the water and this was the sake. So you could just help yourself to the local sake. Because the sake is, is easier to, to get than the water. I better get some water. Or should I get some sake? Oh my gosh. And I know. Just look. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, that's tea. I thought that was sake. Ah, mugi cha, mugi cha. Mugi cha, mugi cha. All right, let's get, uh, let's get on the bus. Everybody's gone. Everybody's gone. I had to use the toilet too. I don't think that's gonna happen before. I can't live stream and go to the restroom. How do you go to the... Everybody forgot their swag. Everybody forgot their swag. I think so, stuff we all get. Don't forget your swag. <laughs> Nothing but the best. Yes, it's heavy. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Well, thank you, Diana. Thank you. <laughs> you know, that's a lot of sake in there. It's a, this is an awesome venue for the welcome lunch. Leo, time to go. Kanae. Wow. You walk outside and that's your view. That's great. That's so countryside. It's a bus tour. Everybody can put their stuff in the bus and uh, if you get tired, you can hang out inside the bus where there's air conditioning. Are you streaming? I think so. Well. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> my, my wife and daughters might be watching. Oh, hey. What are their names? Miyuki, Abby, Katie. Yuki, Abby, and Katie. Are you are you watching? <laughs> I hope so. You having a good time? Oh yeah. <laughs> Lunch is great. 
You full? full? Not full enough? I'm not sure. A little bit of space? Your theory about the humidity dropping up. So I thought it was. Fun. It's a little hot. It's a little hot. People are spending, we're spending the night, oh yeah, please. People are spending the night uh, and uh, we have ample space for suitcases, which is fantastic. Uh, I don't, the signal for some reason was really not that great down here. So hopefully we can get the bus moving. I'll take you aboard the bus. You take a look here. Just for the record. <laughs> That's kind of cool. I don't know if they needed my name on there though. <laughs> I feel a little shy, my name is on the bus. Wow. And we have Koi on, uh, on, the, on the bus as well. So you just have to remember the license plate because there's gonna be a bunch of other buses. So it's 2680. We have a security guard, a driver. It's a pretty comfortable bus. It's a good unit. Ah, what's inside the bag? Check it out. Oh, it's a happy. Hey! A cushion, you're gonna need that, yeah. Yeah, and? To stay hydrated. Kubota Junmai Daiginjo, wow. <laughs> That's the expensive stuff. So good. Yeah. Hello again. Yeah. <laughs> Not to he always gets me. All oh, right, and the bag, which you can keep. <laughs> yeah, right. Echo bag, little only in Japan logo action. Very cool. And there's there's still some empty seats, so if you still sign up, <laughs> it's the time. I think maybe too Come late down. here. <laughs> yeah, we gotta get her, get her happy on. So we, we can find everybody based on the amount of uh, uh, the blue happy that everyone has, so we can find our group. The tough part is after the fireworks, finding everybody and making sure everyone's accounted for so we can come back. <laughs> or else, we're supposed to be back to the hotel by midnight. It normally takes 20 minutes from the event to get back, and the event probably ends around 10, 15-ish. But the problem is there could be traffic, so the worst case scenario is midnight. Yeah. Satrio, I think we might have one happy for you, so. We'll keep it uh, warm. It's also nice, it's also nice to have, uh, in the country that Leo has more space to play, which is good. This is our portable stroller. Very American. I think she might need help. I'm the one who usually... Oh, there we go, okay. that extra sake? Extra sake. Really? <laughs> what kind of trip is this? Oh hey, oh that looks nice. Look at that. Oh, very stylish. Is it one size fits all? I think so. After that lunch, I don't know if it's <laughs> I don't know if it's, uh, if it's big enough or small enough. Oh, I don't know. Leo, where are you going? Leo! <laughs> He's with Aunt, Aunt Rondi. Leo! He picked his... Oh, he doesn't want to sit here? Okay. Of course, 
at the Shinkansen, I, I went out and got coffee and I just made it in time. Just so you know, I didn't miss the train. <laughs> but I did have to run. Could I said, I want to have a soy latte. I said, are you sure? I think there's time. And there was. It was just slightly tight. The, the great thing about, so the, look at this, this is my view. The great thing about not having um, a, a full bus, 18 people, it's very easy to keep track of everybody. So the, the head count went by pretty quickly. At least I hope it did. Is that what, I, am I supposed to do the head count? There's a microphone also for karaoke in here. So, technically on the way home, we could break out those mics and depending on the amount of sake that has been consumed, there might be some karaoke. But we're not going to be at the hotel room for another 11 hours. I think we're going to get back earlier than that. I think we're going to get back earlier. All right, let's drive and show you some of the countryside. is going to tell us all about it. Hi everybody, how was the, how the lunch? Today? It was awesome! Good. Yeah, thank you so much. That is the local uh, mother cooking uh, special lunch today. Okay, uh, we are now heading to the fireworks place to to see uh, the fireworks thank you, Alice. at 2 o'clock. So before that is uh, we just drop by the hotel. You you just uh, in the city, in the bus, and we decided to bring your here's suitcases. A, here's the hotel. Fireworks place because of uh, I worry about if you. That's the uh, onsen. Something. Uh, and there's the okay, rooms the overlooking off of a cliff. Come back to hotel. Awesome. So we bring all the suitcases to the fireworks place. So San Rora so Hotel. If you remember, oh, I forgot to my things in my in my suitcases. We you, we still can get in in uh, fireworks place. Don't worry. Okay, so that's a nice this is nice hotel. hotel. We come back after fireworks. Wow, five stars. Yeah, wow. Five star hotel. <laughs> hotel Why are they laughing? <laughs> He is Mr. Mitsuochi, general manager in here, but he was a cooker for Japanese rice. Wait, so the, wow, the general manager of the hotel was also the restaurant chef? <laughs> That's crazy! <laughs> well, he cooked the rice, right? Yeah. The, the general manager of the hotel cooked the rice yeah, for the lunch. That's yeah. <laughs> crazy. Yeah, exactly. Just take a look inside really quickly. Stuff. It's a very nice hotel. Wow. Sugoine. Oh, they, look at that! They got food vending machines? What? Alright, we're gonna have to check that out later. What are you doing here? Leo sleeping? Looks like maybe Leo sleeping. Ah, thank you, Michelle. So we call him when we return. It's, they got a food vending machine in there, one of the weird ones. <laughs> awesome! <laughs> Next stop, Lawson's. Okay, next place, convenience store. <laughs> Please get uh, your, your drinks. 
Store. Yeah, of course you can buy in any vending machine or or the yatai food store. Also selling, uh, but not many variety of this. So if you want to buy some uh, your favorite things, you can buy from the convenience store now. Wow, this is not Tokyo anymore. On this bus, we're, it's mostly doing long, uh, short hops. So typically, we're gonna stop off at convenience stores at um, Michi no Eki local places that have restrooms on the trip. So it was 40 minutes. That, that's a good question. So there's no toilet on the bus, but we're not really going long distances inside of the bus, and the bus is stopping quite frequently within areas where there are restrooms. So. We have that option, although I'm okay with a porta potty. Okay, we are going down to uh, Katakai Ojiyo City. Uh, you, you can find out we are on a, in a hill to go down. Actually, this uh, location is. All, all done by uh, this Uonogawa River and Shinanogawa River. It's make it to this land. Right. Wow. Okay, this is uh, uh, Lawson. Rice. Uh, we going to have a 10 minute stop. It's okay. 10 and minutes at Lawson. Yeah, 10 minutes. If you don't need to buy anything, please remain the seat. Yeah. If you need to buy something, those people want to go and buy, please go. あめ降りますか雨。降りますか雨。オッケー。降らないよね。うん。そう、レインコートいらないです。うん。いや。あ、インケース、サムシング。インケース。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。